They knew what they were talking about. Hecla was very experienced because they, I mean, they've been underground miner for 100 years. Hecla came in here and said, let's get down to business. They are very forward thinking. Um, all the remote mucking, all of the, the remote drillers. From an environmental standpoint, Greens Creek is world class. What we do out here in the kind of environment that we have is just outstanding. I've always been extremely proud of our environmental record and will stand by that till the day, day I die. I think with our generation, it's different because we, um, how we're growing up right now, we're everybody's very future conscious. So, I mean, mining's always gotten a bad rep, but I think with who we've got coming up, we can change that. I mean, I wouldn't work for a company that did it any other way. The individuals that work here, they won't sleep at night if they aren't making the right decisions. Greens Creek does a really good job on safety. I know here in the mill, Today, the mill operations group 1,200 days without a lost time accident, today. Mining's not the mining that it was when our grandfathers were around. We've learned from our mistakes and we're putting those lessons to play every day here in our classroom. There's great support for mining here in Southeast Alaska and at the same time a real desire to see more young people from Juneau and surrounding communities find good paying occupations uh, in the mining industry here in Southeast. Without HECLA, there would be no Center for Mine Training. Um, it's their gift that makes all this training possible. Mining's not going anywhere in Alaska. If anything, if we're going to be green in the future, that's going to mean more minerals. So we're going mining.